Referrals, important in real life and online. What's up socials, happy social Thursday. Today I'm gonna to do a quick tutorial for you on the computer on how you can find out what the top referring social networks are for your website. You might be using bit.ly links or other kinds of tools to kind of get an idea of how links are performing in social, but you really want cold hard analytics when it comes to this stuff so you know what social networks are working best for you because why spend time somewhere that's not. Let's go over to the computer, shall we? All right, friends, first and most importantly, I hope you have Google Analytics installed on your website because that is what we're going to be working with today. If you do not have an analytics software, even if it's not Google running on your website, you are missing a lot of opportunities to measure success and failures. So please make sure that you have this included in the back end of your site before you're worried about the highest referring social media networks because quite frankly you're not going to be able to find out without so i'm just going to click over here this is just a getting started page if you google google analytics you'll get some instructions here on how you can include it but i'm going to switch over to my analytics now once you're in Google Analytics, you're gonna have your dashboard here, and this is where you will appear first. But I've actually clicked on the section called Acquisition. This is how you are acquiring people to your website. And when you click on Overview, this is what you'll see. You'll get an idea of how much direct traffic you're getting, basically how many people are typing your URL and going there, how many people are finding you in organic search results, meaning not paid search results, how much traffic you're getting from social, and and of course, other referral traffic. Social used to be included in referral, but now it has its own little category because referral traffic can mean a lot of things. Somebody can link to you from their website, et cetera, et cetera. But we wanna look at social. So if we click that section and scroll down, you'll see a list of options here, and it'll show you your top referring social network. So number one for me is Twitter. Obviously, you guys know I have a very high uh, presence presence on Twitter. It's one of my favorite social networks and also a great way for my target audience to say, stay subscribed. Facebook is right behind at number two. And then the rest of them are pretty much whatever. Um, YouTube, it says it doesn't send a lot of referrals. And this is a time frame of the last 28 days. Um, but this is actually not totally correct because usually when I'm directing people from YouTube, they're going to a landing page that looks like my website but is actually uh, lead pages or some sort of landing page. So this metric isn't totally correct and in all actuality, YouTube does send a ton of traffic. But if we're considering the other social networks and not necessarily a content medium, Twitter and Facebook are number one for me. So this is how you check your top referring social networks. Hopefully this will give you a good idea of just how much of the work you're doing on social actually is mattering to your traffic. That's all for today's socials. Thank you so much for tuning in. I appreciate it as always. Make sure you check out the top five things you need to know before you make your first video blog. That's right, if you wanna do stuff like this, there's a couple things you need to know, but then I want you to execute and just start creating video. So go check that out, it's in the card over there. Click, sign up, you'll get it immediately. So you'll love it. Make sure you find me on iTunes. The Marketing Lifestyle Show has a new episode tomorrow I want you to listen to. So I hope to see you there and then we'll be back on YouTube next week for Savvy Tuesday.